<clears throat> Yo, ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? How you doing today? It's one more of those episodes of Effed Up Radio. All up in your ear hole, ready to sit there like a baby bird, ready to pop out the, the knowledge <laughs> of life. And <laughs> today we... <laughs> Today we have uh, some special guests. Today, first we're gonna have Koofy with the Koof over here and do some soup. But he said, "Boy, Kenneth Stones, aka Coffee Weezy." You know, one half of the Dirty Hill podcast, but I am here, <laughs> fucked up radio comedy podcast. Boop, 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 boop. Sorry. <laughs> and we also have the greatest, the best, the ultra superstar. I'm not going to press any buttons because you know I'm going to fuck it up. <laughs> and we have... Sorry. Yo! Let's go. Yes. Did it right this it's time. It's your friendly neighborhood home boys, Boofa. Hey, yo. Let's go. And let's not forget the boom box. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> yes, sir. Nice. Always nice fire. on deck. Nice. My inspiration, my motivation. It is my Frankie. To Coco, it is my Damien. To Jake Roberts, uh. it is my head to Al Snow. Oh, mm. Not that way, don't get it wrong. <laughs> Pause all the way, ayo, for a reason, <laughs> if you know what I mean. Yeah. But you get it, so yes. <laughs> okay, I'm here in the building. Nice, yes. nice. Thanks so, for having me. Yeah, that's what's up. Oh, I'm glad you here. Getting effed up tonight. Hell yeah. Definitely. <clears throat> you know, if you're smoking, get the smokes oh. out. If you're drinking, put it in that cup. Get that ice out and let's do it. Let's let's get it, go. baby. Let's yes, it. sir. So, um, I know you got a lot of a lot of big matches coming up. Do you have any any matches you you're really waiting to start? Hey, man, I got a match this Saturday oh. in the Boogie Down Bronx, New oh, York, in the mm-hmm. Bronx. for a WWX. I'll be taking on Mel. He's a guy that started maybe about, i say, a year, mm-hmm. about a year or two after I started at the doghouse. Okay. Mm-hmm. So, you know, he started coming up the ranks. Nice. You know, while I was away overseas, he's been doing his thing here. On Mel, the scene. Mel Blonferry? Yes, sir. That's oh, my guy. Okay. And Mel also is the man behind the Guy Jean Musu theme song. Mm. Oh, oh nice. yeah. So nice. you know, so shout out. You know he he's big on you know the strong style. Mm-hmm. You know, as okay. he should be. You know, then, then uh, you back in the in the states. How much different is wrestling from in the states than overseas? Oh, What's the big, biggest difference? Well. I would have to break it down to countries, you know? Uh-huh. So, I, right now, currently, I live in Shenzhen, China, so... Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'll break it down from China. We'll, we'll get back to that. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, how's yeah, that? No doubt. No doubt. <laughs> like, but in China, pro wrestling is about, I would say, seven years old. Mm. Oh, okay. wow. You know? Not it's still, yeah, it's still in his infant stages, so <clears throat> a lot of the guys aren't that experienced. Mm-hmm. You know, they're still learning, so mm-hmm. that's the difference. But on the other hand, a lot of the companies that were started in China mm-hmm. were run by guys with money, like wow. actual like promoters, guys that know what they're doing, you know, mm-hmm. guys that were currently in business guys who have businesses currently you know Mm -hmm. so they wind up you know starting a wrestling company because 
one of the wrestlers was looking for investors to run the show, you know. Mm -hmm. So that's how, like, a lot of these companies in China started. So the production value was there. Mm -hmm. So when you see, like, a lot of my matches from China, a lot of people talk about, like, oh, man, those are some, like, dope arenas you, you be wrestling in. And I'm like, yeah, man, like... There's money behind these promotions, you know? Mm, yeah, definitely. You know, the guys, they not, they're not experienced. You can see, you mm. know, the ring. I always say the ring doesn't lie, so you can tell they're not that experienced. <laughs> but you look at the production value, you're like, <clears throat> okay. Make, make them look dope. Yeah. Yeah, they're going to, they, people are going to watch a little longer, you know, mm. even though what they're seeing isn't like up to their standards like it is here in the states where the standards are high because wrestling has been around for how many yeah. years you know yeah but on an independent level uh they they have the indies beat mm. in this way really because these these guys are covering your travel you know that's not a problem. Whether it's by bus, train, or flight, yeah. Oh yeah, I can deal with that. Yeah, transportation is covered. You know, uh, hotel yeah. as well, and your match pay. Okay. You're wow. getting that. You know. Guaranteed. And on top of that, when I was in China, I was under contracts. Like every time I've been in China, uh -huh. and I've been away for years, it's because. A company out there signed me to a contract, mm. and in Asia you get paid monthly. You don't get you don't get paid like every week here in oh, the states or bi monthly. Okay. So you know you get a big like lump sum yeah. every month. So I'm under contract. I'm getting paid a few thousand every month. Mm -hmm. They provided me with uh, an apartment to stay at cool. or a house or whatever. Everything is taken care of, bro. Nice. So. That's the difference. Like, it's all business there. Well, Definitely. when I was there, put it this way. When I was there, now it's, a, it's, it's different now. Mm -hmm. It's not as good now. That's why, like, I'm transitioning out of, like, wrestling there. Mm -hmm. I stopped wrestling in China recently, you know, because a lot of... Politics. A lot of BS happened, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So I was like, all right, cool. I got I to gotta re-strategize and focus on my main goal which is to open up my own promotion mm -hmm. and eventually dojo. Okay. So that was one of the main reasons why I even came back to the States because I wanted to lock down a date and a location for my first show. Mm -hmm. So I figured, you know, instead of doing my show in China first, mm -hmm. why don't I bring it back home where it all started? Yes. Let me have my first show in Hunts Point in my hood. Let's do it. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So I came back, spoke with a few people. You know, shout out to the Boogie Down Cafe. They're big supporters of mine. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So I pretty much have a month locked down for next year. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna get it we're gonna get it popping, man. It's gonna be fire. You know, we're gonna yeah. we're gonna we're gonna do it up, you know what I mean? Can't wait to see it. It's yeah, gonna nope. be fire. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. Be amazing. Mm -hmm. You got any questions for him, G? What you got for him? We, I, I want to know how, how, what it's like living in. What, what was the the town you're living in? Ah, uh, Shenzhen. Shenzhen. How, Shenzhen. What is Shenzhen like? It's a city in China. It's one of the cities in China, one of the big cities. Mm -hmm. You know, you got Shenzhen, then you got Guangzhou, you got Beijing. Mm -hmm. You know, you got these different big, big different cities. You know. Okay. So it's it's uh, it's is it, it's different. Is it like yeah, man? It's different. Is it like, you know, how it is over here? Is it like they got they separating high class people, Macy's people from the from the dollar store people, or <laughs> like, is it like everybody's nah, nah. together? Every, <laughs> out there, honestly, man, everybody's together. Okay. Yo, to tell you to tell you the truth, because I live in a nice apartment complex. You know what I mean? That's what you want to hear. It's a dope spot, but like, yo, the people they don't give a. Like, <laughs> my my wife is saying it. She was like, yo, you got a lot of, because, like, Shenzhen is a tech city. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Tech city, so it's like, it's not a lot of, a lot of um, entertainment there. You know, people are just working. Oh, well, so yeah. you got a lot of the people that live in Shenzhen mm -hmm. aren't from Shenzhen. Okay. They live out in the countryside and shit. <laughs> 
So, oh. you know what I mean? Yeah. That, that's cool, though. So they bringing some of their lifestyle to the city with, you know, these other folks that might be more high class. So mm-hmm. it's going to be a mix of the two. That's cool. So, you know, it's like, yo, it's, everybody's just rocking with each other. Yeah. Pretty much, you know what I mean? <laughs> At least in least in Shenzhen. Yeah. And like <laughs> Shanghai, like the places I've lived, like mm-hmm. everybody's just like together. It doesn't even mm-hmm. matter. Oh you well, know? you you know, Shang Shanghai is uh is uh on the top of the board because mm-hmm. because Jackie Chan promotes it. Oh, okay, so, okay. So yeah. you you already yeah. know it's, I lived there. It's prestige. I right. lived there. That was um uh I would say that was the first city I lived in in China was um, Shanghai. Okay. Mm. Yeah, a company brought me out there uh, back in 2019, I, I believe. Mm. It was OWE. They had a working relationship with AEW. Okay. Like around the time AEW first started. Mm-hmm. Cool. They was the, the Chinese company that AEW was working with. Nice. That company hired me. And they was located in uh, Shanghai. Oh, that's dope. Yeah, so I lived there for like, oh, man, probably like a year. Oh, wow. Before I moved to um, Shenzhen. Yeah, man. So so have you you met anyone? Like, uh, I would say uh, famous over there besides, (laughs) like, somebody like Jackie Chan. Like, that's a touchable type. Like, nah. I mean, like a, like a craftsman or anybody that, like, made a sword or something? Uh, honestly, nah, man. I don't... You said a craftsman. <laughs> <laughs> you never know. Like, like people, the blacksmith. Yeah, Yo, yeah. I, I probably have, and I just don't know it, you mm-hmm. know? Because yeah. I've, I've met a lot of people and, like, a lot of, like, important people before mm. in China, but, you know, I don't I don't understand the language, so... Yeah. You mm. know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. It's always the Like, problem. they all look like... They were somebody, but <laughs> yeah. I couldn't really tell. You know, I'm a I'm a I'm a black jack dude in China, so yeah. I'm getting all this attention from everybody, mm-hmm. to low class to high class. Like, mm-hmm. and have they tried to wash their skin off yet? Uh, nah, nah, man. I ain't. How many times? Have <laughs> nah, you, that ain't happening, bro. How many times have, have, to, have you got offered to touch your hair? Oh, oh man. that's a good question. No, no, that's something that I'm just, yeah, yeah. I get asked that <laughs> a lot, bro. <laughs> a lot? Still? Yo. Even that more yeah, than a year? Yeah, man, I had, <laughs> yo, you know it's crazy? <laughs> I did, what was it? Last time I was in Japan last year. Oh, man. Like, we had me and my boy, my boy Dylan that I team up with. Mm-hmm. The dude that uh, Guy G Muscle, yeah. my um, taxi partner. Okay. We had um, produced our own wrestling show in um, Japan. Nice. Last year, so that was like a big accomplishment for us. Nice. So, one of the sponsors is a um, owner of a bar, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. but he's also like a huge like wrestling mark and shit. Mm-hmm. And like he used to mark out to us in Japan. When like Zero One used to come to the um town, yeah. he used to go to the shows and shit, and he was like one of the sponsors for the company. Mm-hmm. He would like sell the tickets at the bar and shit like that. Oh wow! So that working? Yeah, he helped yeah. us. You know, he helped us like produce the show and shit. So mm-hmm. after the show, I think it was like around the time of the show, or like maybe around the time we was like setting up the show and shit. Mm-hmm. There was a stardom show in like the um city that we um was in wakayama mm. it's like probably like 30 minutes off from osaka okay. Ta- you said so it's like Waka- <laughs> wakayama oh. <laughs> wakayama <Sorry>. yeah <laughs> it's wakayama city so okay it's basically like osaka so it's like down south and shit yeah. oh yeah so there was a, a stardom show there so one of the fucking uh stardom wrestlers is there with some chick. Mm-hmm. So, you know, we pull up and shit, be chilling. So the bar owner is like, ah, oh, he's introducing us to them and shit like that. And he's like, ah, oh, do you know her? We're like, nah. He's like, ah, oh, he's she's a stardom wrestler. We're like, oh, okay, cool. You know? <laughs> yeah. Like, you know, we don't watch wrestling. <laughs> yeah. We don't we don't know who 
motherfuckers are. They <laughs> ain't watching the shit. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, oh, cool. You a worker? All right, what's up? Yeah, nice. <laughs> so we chilling and shit, and, like, the chick that she's with is asking about my hair. And mm. she's looking at my hair and shit, and I'm like, yeah, it's oh, nice. Man, yeah. So the, the the worker chick is like, yeah, <laughs> she had you have braids just like her because the chick had her hair like braided or something. Mm-hmm. Oh, she- so she was like, ah, oh, do you know how to braid? I was like, yeah, a little bit. So she was like, ah, oh, teach me. She's like, please teach me. I'm like, oh shit. I'm like, yo, now it's my turn. Yeah. Now it's my turn to play with their hair. I'm like, okay. Yeah. Yeah. I'm braiding the chicks here. Yeah, <laughs> and the cool. chick is recording it and shit. That's funny. I'm like, yo, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm like, yeah, yeah finally too. somebody got to flip that shit. Yeah. yeah. I did it yeah. too. That's nice. I took my I took my opportunity for for the people. <laughs> uh. That was cool. Uh, <laughs> Definitely. Um, growing up, who was your favorite wrestler? Oh man, uh X Pac. Oh shit. Really? What, one, two, three, Word. kid. Really? Out of all the wrestlers he picked, I was like, X Pac. <laughs> <What>? Really? <laughs> Like, I don't, you know, that's all right. Damn. <laughs> Everybody, Damn. Everybody's entitled. You know, yeah. you know. You know <laughs> X-Pac. You know what? You know what? That's a, that's a good X-Pac, he got a, a fan. Okay. I'm not, that's I'm a good not, choice because he's a good wrestler. Yeah. yeah. He was always dope. Yes. But this is the thing. <laughs> At the time, he was one, two, three kid. Yeah. So when people would ask me and I would tell them one, two, three kid, they would laugh. Because <laughs> this is when this, this motherfucker was jobbing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And they would laugh at me. They expected me to say somebody big, like, probably, like, fucking, who was, like, a big baby face at the time, like, Bret Shawn Hart. Michaels or somebody. Or, yeah, Shawn Michaels. I'm like, one, two, three, kid. You was, like, was, uh, was going for baby faces back then? Of course, man. Like, I, I was, I I'm don't a, know. Do you, I'm a natural baby face, so. Yeah. Was, was, was Ultimate Warrior baby face? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, he was. Yeah, he okay. did a lot of hillish shit, I was, but I was, I was, that is true. I was a big Ultimate Warrior fan. You know I, I what? Wasn't sure, he was on the line. That's debatable, man. <laughs> yeah, he was on the line. <laughs> that's something that that's something we need to look into. Was Ultimate Warrior really a baby face? Cause yeah. he used to press yeah. damn niggas out the ring. Yeah, and he used to come in the ring. Ah, ah, yo, <laughs> yo, <laughs> everybody yeah. thought he was. A he used to, he used to, B. he used to wreck those jobbers, bro. He'd have, well, his match wasn't didn't didn't last that long. He, he was super high. Yeah, yeah. I He'd mean, have like a five minute match. They should have had less well, long. Okay, but honestly, he um some I, of them. I saw some backstory with that with uh, Hulk Hogan. Yeah, and you know that that behind the ring shit. That, yeah, that they did. He was saying that Ultimate Warrior a lot of the times came <laughs> fucked up. Oh shit! <laughs> like he, he came to the fight, fucked up. Nigga, like that, that's why he couldn't do a lot of the moves. He was moving fast, oh, like he, he was shit. fucked up. <laughs> I can believe that. So, yeah, I you mean, know, so they had to talk to him a couple it, times. It makes you know? sense. You see him, like yeah, like you saw it. This dude was uh, people. This dude was always like, like tuned up. Yeah, uh, fucking Texas tornado. Mm. Have you ever, they talk about that. Like, he used to be tuned up in his matches, like, off that stuff. Have you ever, have you, have you ever listened to Ultimate Warrior's promo? Oh, hell yeah. I love his promos. It's fucking ridiculous. Like, Yo. they're asking him about a fight. He, he starts talking about planets. It's like the world's alive. The gods. <laughs> like, every, like, and then it's like, all right. When, when, but, but when, when are you going to do that to Hulk Hogan, though? He's yeah. Like, but... But the universe is coming together in the planets. The planets, I can see the planets. Uh, <laughs> and it's like, oh shit. What is it? <laughs> yo. It's like, what? That, All right. That commitment is I felt, something, yeah, bro. I, I felt, yo, Mean Gene was a thug. He was, yo, yo, he was there for the worst of it. Yeah. He was there for yo, the worst he, of it. Yo, he would just laugh. He, he was would just holding laugh that at little people. arm out there. <laughs> he, was like, yeah. he was ready for he it. He said, hold his little arm out there. Yeah, he was yo, just, he would just <laughs> laugh at people. I've seen Mean Gene tell people to shut up, though. Yeah. Mm, when, when he had enough, mm-hmm. he'll tell you, please be quiet. <laughs> yeah, 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 that's, that's hilarious. not necessary. You know, he cut them off too. When, yeah. when he did it to Piper, the whole world stopped. They was like, oh shit, he told Piper to shut up. <laughs> <laughs> like, everybody, Piper respected it. He was like, it's me, G. It's you me, yeah. G. Gotcha. <laughs> yeah, like, Piper Hell was yeah, one of the gotta greatest. respect it, man. Who's your uh, favorite hill? Damn, man. That's tough. <laughs> nope. 
he, when he started, he was a baby face. Shit. Damn, that's that. tough, man. I was going to say Sting, but when he started, he was a baby face. I mean, but you could still say Sting is a hill. I mean, different versions of Sting. That's true. As a hill? Yeah, did, uh, isn't Joker Sting a hill? It's Crow Sting. Yeah, but they have also have like the Joker Sting. Uh, I mean, he was. No, that was, that was that uh, was that was a uh, Wolfpack, uh, Wolfpack Sting. Oh, okay. That nigga Sting was nothing but fucking yeah, Stone Cold. <laughs> yeah. That nigga was nothing but Stone Cold because he used to beat up the baby faces too. Yeah. That yeah. first. So that's what I'm saying. Is that consider, <laughs> that, does that make him a baby face because he's beating up the heels? You know? I think I it all he depends was like, on the story. He was like also. one of... I can't... Nah, I can't say the first Trinas because I'm sure there's, there was Trinas like in the 80s and shit. Definitely. But... I don't know. He, I guess he was you like remember, uh, scary know. Sherry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She, she was flip flopping. Like you, you didn't know if she was good or bad. Nah, I think <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought. I think if you always saw her, she was always. She was usually with hill. Hit. Yeah. Hill. She was baby she had, with like uh, all of heat. Yeah. All At one point. <laughs> that is true. <laughs> Piss me off. They wasn't even from Harlem. Yo. Now can you yo, take that, sucker? Yo. <laughs> it pissed me off. They wasn't even from yo, Harlem. Yo, I'm heartbroken. Because I'm, I'm originally from Harlem. Come I'm, on a, now. I'm a Harlem Come boy. On now. Imagine walking in 110th. Yo. Come, the, yo. The Undertaker and, is really not from Death Valley. We, we didn't know that. <laughs> like, yo, yes, we, we didn't did. know that. Yes, we, we didn't did. know what Death Valley was, so we ain't care. We knew where I thought Death Valley was really was. a place. <laughs> you we sick. knew, we knew 110th Street. He said they from no, 110th <laughs> Street. 110th. I know Crenshaw. Yo. <laughs> I, I done walked through 110th Street asking everybody, y'all know Booker? Yo, I remember y'all know, my... Y'all know Booker? Yo, I remember my mom was like, yo, I'm going to ask my friends if they know them. <laughs> my mom used to go... You should be asking her friends if they know Harlem Heat. <laughs> Yo, I really thought they was from home. Yo, so you was trying to track them down. You would have never found Harlem Yo. Heat, but you would have damn sure found Mr. T. You probably oh, would've. shit. You would have found Mr. T in Harlem. He used, to hang, out. Too. He used to hang out like he... Like Yo, my, I never my mama seen, live up the street. I never seen him in Harlem. <laughs> like, my mama live up the street. Like, I, I wish I would have seen Flavor him in Harlem. Flavor, too. Mr. T is a cool brother. Flavor, wow. Flavor Flav, you could catch him on the corner. Boy. Yo, yeah, I heard he used to be on yeah. on a Kong Force, like, cracked out. Mm-hmm. Yo, Flavor Flav, you used to Yo. see him anywhere you want. <laughs> Flavor Flav looks like he's still cracked out. Yeah. Yo. <laughs> like, he, he look like... Yeah. Uh, but he's mad smart. Yeah, he is. Yo, he he's is. like a musician I'm... and shit. <laughs> <laughs> he can play the piano and... Word? Yo, yeah. nice. Like genius level type yeah, shit. Yeah. 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 He, Ugly he, as hell, though. He getting his ass <laughs> shirt on. <laughs> <laughs> he, he getting his ass shirt on. Listen, between him <laughs> Yo. and Danny Glover, they got to be the ugliest nigga. Nah, ever. you can't say Danny Glover. Nah, clearly. Nah, you can't Danny be Danny just, in there. Danny just oh, He not ugly. There's a Boy, few. There's a few that can go in there before <laughs> Danny. Yeah, ugly, yeah. Danny, uh, Danny Glover <laughs> okay. terrible. Uh, okay, I'm, who's... who's <laughs> okay, I know who you could put next to Flavor Flav. Uh, Michael Blackson. Yo, <laughs> yeah, seal. He, he is not a pretty. Yes, he is him as well. <laughs> he is him as well. Kiss by your rose yeah, Yo. on my face. Ooh. You remember the? You remember the dude from Five Heartbeats? <laughs> oh, the uh, nigga Red. Nice like this. Red. Uh, red. Yo, you know he. Yo. Be, but you know he's always in Harlem. You you gotta get Red in there. That nigga is a weird looking motherfucker. Yeah, he's weird motherfucker. Uh, yeah. That nigga, lo- yo, it's the first time I seen a light skinned dude with red hair. I was like, yo, what is he? Is he black? Is he a light skinned dude with a red hair? And he was mad angry too. What is that's he? How, that's how Jadenum looks. Jadenum. Yo, I used to think anybody that looked like that nigga was evil. Wow. Like, yo, why he got waves in his? Head. <laughs> Man, my grandma had yeah, those. Yeah, finger waves. My grandma used to have that head. Yo, you gotta, you gotta to watch work. that scene where he beats the dude up. Oh yeah. Yo, the dude sold the fuck out that beating. Yo, you gotta. Said my office bro. hours up from that. You gotta, you gotta watch the dude. He so. I was like, crying. yo, he said nah. I think they really I wanna fucked talk him to up. You now about yeah. my my books. The nigga was like, uh, hold on he now, said, baby. Hold on. Hold on. First off, first off, you said you gotta hear the joke he was telling in the beginning, though. The nigga was like, so, listen, I tells him, hell nah, you can't. That's how he was telling yo, bro. Yeah. That's that's the funny part, because he was telling the nigga the joke, and then he turns yeah. around. He says, yeah, hold on, brother. Yeah, and then Keith proceeds to tell the joke. 
Oh, that was, was hilarious. Yo, and that nigga got pissed. He was like, nah. <laughs> Hold on, he beat the nigga ass and then mm-hmm. told the ladies, excuse me, ladies. <laughs> beat the shit out of him. But he, when he hit him, he hit him so hard, like you thought it was thundercrack. It was like, Poof. that nigga said, ah. ah. <laughs> so, so the way he sold that shit, yo. <laughs> so now my office like, hours bro. are from what? Uh-huh. I'm telling anybody, you want to... You want to know how to sell? Watch that scene. Yeah. yeah if no. you can recreate that shit in a match, you can sell. <laughs> oh, man. Nah. What's a, a movie that you could, mm. you could like, recreate the storyline for a match? Oh, shit. Huh, that's a good one. Damn. Ooh. Like, I do juice. Have my father's. Oh, uh, juice like, is my like, look, shit. I do juice. I love juice. And then I'd fight. I'd fight somebody that looks like my father every week. Damn. But we would never uh, fight. We would just get in the ring and play chess every time. <laughs> juice. Hmm. Shit. Fuck. That's a tough one, bro. Yeah. I don't know. I could man. be Craig. My homeboy could be like Smokey. Yeah. You know what I mean? We never really actually have a match until mm-hmm. Big Worm comes. And Debo, uh, we fight Big yeah. Worm and Debo every week. Uh, <laughs> yo, <laughs> that's hilarious. What you got for him, G? Mm. I'm, I'm still, I'm still pondering, my dude. Oh, yeah, uh, that, that's a good one. That's a, yeah, man, that's tough, bro. I guess I'm gonna go with damn. I'm gonna go with the Warriors, bro. Mm, that's you could a do good that. Choice. I'll, I'll, be, I'll be down with like a, a fucking Survivor Series yeah, match every simple. like. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Get my boys, we do a Survivor Series style elimination. Yeah, that's you a know? long trip. But though. the old school, the old school Survivor Series where it's like the ultimate survivor. Mm, the one guy, the left. last nigga that survives, bro. The one guy. Like left. the match started with like fifteen niggas. Yeah. It was like ten niggas on the apron. Oh. <laughs> you I ever seen it. them joints? <laughs> yeah, I got it. I just Yo, got it. <clears throat> them joints is hot, bro. That was okay. just shit. So. Mines will be Double Dragon. Ooh. Double I'm, ga- dragon, I'm gonna wear the red suit. Yeah. Oh, that nigga gonna wear the blue suit. Yeah. Be like, you took my girl. And he'd be like, no, I didn't. And I'd be like, oh. <laughs> that'd, be, that'd be like a little fire storyline to uh, concept. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cause they always fighting anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That'd be fire. <laughs> that'd be fire. Yeah. Yo, for real. And then we walk off, we walk off like, I'm sorry. Uh, we start holding bro. hands. Yeah. Brother. Word. Like, let's show her the Chinese finger trap. If, uh... <laughs> if he said the Chinese finger trap. Yo, bro, remember, the, remember them joints? What was the yo, joints? I hated them little yeah. joints like yo, this, right? Yo, it's like your finger stuck, bro. Uh, yo, I, I, I still don't know how to take them shits off. How you used oh, to you do it? Like, it's got to squeeze, squeeze right? Yeah. No, you got to push in first to push out. Oh, really? Ah, I thought you had to like, it, squeeze. I, yeah, I thought when, that too. When, I thought you had to squeeze it. When somebody's helping you, <laughs> yeah, oh, you shit. squeeze it, but... If it's just oh. you by yourself, you push it in. Ah, uh, it I'd makes be, sense. Yeah. I'd be that one dumbass. Like, excuse me, I need to go Yo, to the ambulance. Uh. I, need, I call the fucking ambulance. <laughs> I'm I'm 41 and I'm finding now how to get out that shit, right? <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, yeah, man. It's like those, those are one of the, that was another one of those useless facts I be having because I, I had a I conversation. Love those, man. I yeah, love those, man. Yeah, those. Hell yeah. I had a conversation about aglets and it, it, went, it didn't go right. Aglet. <laughs> so no, what? I, I, I just thought I'd leave it alone. Aglet. But well, just to let you know. Aglets are the little clear part of the shoelace. That's the name of it. Wow. Don't ask me why I know that, but yeah, I know that. I, don't, I didn't know that either. <laughs> wow. But he told me, I was like, really? They, they have a name for that? <laughs> wow. I, like, I just thought they was like the end of the shoelace piece. And yeah. somebody created that shit, too. Exactly. Um, that's what, yeah, exactly. somebody, somebody created somebody that shit. Somebody made that, and, and now mm-hmm. it, has a, it has a name. <laughs> it's just nobody yeah. cares to, to know what the name is yeah, because you, you don't use it. Something happened with somebody who's like, what the fuck? Oh, yeah. It's like, they said, gee, gee, gosh, me, me buckles won't stay. <laughs> <laughs> and then, <laughs> then somebody invented the, yeah. the, the laces with the, with the mm-hmm. little dealy. And the, the shoelace aglets. company had to buy that shit. Yeah. Somebody. <laughs> My nigga said $100 an uh, aglet. Yeah, they then, said, what the fuck is aglet? They yeah. said, you want these shoelaces, right? Mm-hmm. He's like, just give them. Nah, that, that nigga's <laughs> a billionaire. So you said earlier that uh, you had a tag oh. team. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, man. You just started. about to say, Jay? I'm um, young, G? Yeah. No, nah, I just had a stupid question. What was that? <laughs> <laughs> I just had a real stupid question. Dad. What was it? Okay. How, okay. You, you, you're good about history, right? So, how, how much do you think 
Abe Lincoln paid for that hat? Mm. <laughs> That's a good question. Like, I mean, back then, and then we'll calculate Five it. We'll calculate dollars. it to now, money. Five whole <laughs> But back then, how much you think he paid for that hat? Five dollars. Five dollars? Five dollars. You think? Yeah, that, I mean, that is a lot of money back then. That was a lot of money back then. Yeah, that's five dollars. Uh, five dollars back then is like hundred dollars. Yeah, probably five. I'm thinking a quarter. Really? <laughs> really? You ain't think he uh, dropped at least a couple bars of gold for that hat? <laughs> it's like I'm pretty oh, sure no. that shit. Uh, Maybe that hat was like know, somebody. Hand, it, it was special. Somebody huh? handed it down to him. Really? <laughs> I'm trying to. I'm hand trying to figure out like when was hats invented? Like. Hats was themselves? people wearing hats like yeah? yeah. Well, wow. Black people the hats for themselves. I know it was certain. It was certain hats that were made. You know, then it started to evolve. You Into know, helmets. Yes. So I don't know. Like <laughs> hats shit. was made because niggas was hot outside. So hats, you know, hats were made before helmets, but hats, you know, serve a different purpose. <laughs> so yeah, uh, those are the sleeves. Whoa, heat. It was yeah, heat from yeah. the head. But yeah, that, that's mm-hmm. that's that's what normally the slaves would make themselves. They didn't. Mm-hmm. Nobody gave them shit. Them damn, <laughs> it's like them they, damn they, slave they, holding yeah, his patent that shit. They would they would <laughs> take whatever material they had and they they would make a hat out of it. Sew it around their head. Just hat. so they wouldn't. Just so they wouldn't look like Michael Blackson at the end of the day. Sew it around their head. Damn. Yeah. So. <laughs> <laughs> damn. <laughs> so you know, a lot of cultures do it. Uh, you know, black. Spanish. Yeah. You know, you're just trying to stay away from the sun the best way you can, but it's hard to do that when you're getting whipped in the back. Mm-hmm. Yo. <laughs> it was like, you know, the, the hat was the only thing that stayed intact. Uh, <laughs> that was so, personally, I think, I think he dropped at least like six, maybe seven gold bars for that hat. Gold bars? Gold bars. Because gold bars. not only could you hide what they would call the gentleman's pistol in that hat, that I'm pretty sure he was the first one to have a fucking Teflar hat. <laughs> nah, no. he was on the head. Yo, but he had his hat off. He was in a he was in a uh, like a play. Like, yeah, so that's like a movie yeah. theater. Yeah. So back in those days, you can't wear your hat. Mm. <laughs> so they caught him with his hat off. Huh? So mm. Paul caught him with his hat off. He caught <laughs> him with his hat off. So mm. theoretically, he could have had the first Teflar hat. Yo, oh, man, that's crazy. <laughs> like, like, you don't think, think about it. Yeah. If the nigga had to go. They had to get him? Yeah, he caught him point blank range. That shit must have been... So even yeah. if he did have his hat, he could have went under the hat. Yo. Like point Yo. blank range. Like the real reason he did it was because of the hat. Yeah, Isn't that funny? Maybe, that shit was maybe, all... maybe like, he shot him already hat. and the hat was just like... <laughs> Oh, <laughs> then he was like, yo. <laughs> and then he went up there, yo, I'm gonna kill this motherfucker. <laughs> Nobody survives my bullets. Uh, <laughs> it's like, yo. that's some crazy shit to think about. So like, like, after he shot him, he kicked the hat. I'm Fuck telling you, oh, that's, a, that's, a, that's, a, that's a $10 billion mm-hmm. dollar hat today. <laughs> yo, hell yeah. <laughs> yo. Today. Hell yeah, hell yeah. That shit's probably dust right now. Bro. Oh, yeah, definitely. definitely. <laughs> I, I actually saw a, um, a George Washington suit. Mm. The, the the guy that was selling it said the original color was pink, but it looked it looked like a, a George like Washington a, suit was a, pink. off white. Yeah, back then pink was a man's color. Oh, I mean it still <laughs> is. I don't. I, don't, I mean ask yeah. Cameron. You know. Yeah, what I mean? yeah. I'm rocking. I'm from Austin. Yeah. Man. <laughs> so, I'll rock pink in a minute. I had so pink the, gear too. You know, you know oh, how that. the uh, the British soldiers, you know, had the 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 sequence and the buttons and shit. Ah, uh, like, yeah. He had like some pink and white shit, but over, <laughs> over the years, the shit turned into like a, a off white gray type. <laughs> it's uh, like they don't the even hell? look the same. Like it's been so many years, but no. you know, it was a uh, the guy that was selling it. He he did research on stuff like that, like really I old stuff. Damn. Mm-hmm. Yo, you, uh, How much you got for that shit? Yeah, <laughs> hell yeah. <laughs> I wonder. I wonder, yeah, for real. How much bread did he get for the suit? Yeah, like for bills? real. Like, he, that, that actually wasn't for sale. Money. What? The, the, yeah, the, how I saw it was, um, you, you, you ever seen that, that, that pawn show? Uh, yeah. yeah, I used to always yeah. watch that. The, yeah, the yeah. main guy tried to buy that suit. Mm. And he was like, nope, I can't sell it. It's worth too much. Oh, wow. so he was like, how much is, is George Washington's suit? He's like, yeah, I can't sell it to you. Mm. <laughs> he's like, but I can sell you this other shit. <laughs> he's, like, ah. he's like, I'm trying to get both. You know, yeah. I brought a lot of money with me. Damn. He was like, can't, can't let that one go. And then he gave him the whole story. Yo, it used to be mm. used to be pink. That's what everybody used to wear back in the days when you had money. You used to wear pink. 
<laughs> it's like, oh, wow, nigga, I never do that. <clears throat> and he Damn. gave the whole story. Fuchsia. Yeah. Yeah, he gave the whole story of the, of the suit. Damn. Um, but he's like, I'm not selling it, though. What's, like, he just <laughs> said uh, something about something worth being so much. What's the most worthless thing you have in your house? The most worthless thing I have in my house is my yeah. slippers. What about you? <laughs> worthless. Uh, that I've... <laughs> Bought with my money. Yeah. <laughs> I had to put it like that. I bought mad worthless yeah, shit. Slippers. Ah, man. I don't. <laughs> I got a speaker right now that Prob- takes batteries. Bro, I probably. I don't even know. That makes know, it portable, man. you fucking. <laughs> yeah, it's terrible. <laughs> you fucking guy. Probably like some rubber bands or something. Rubber, nah, rubber, rubber bands is always useful if you know how to use them. Especially if you're musical. You're like, um, <laughs> I got. Yeah, I mean. I don't really need to. I don't really need to put them on my hair, but I'm just like, yeah. I got a broken <laughs> game chair it. that I refuse to throw away. All right, it wasn't broken when you bought it. It wasn't. It's broken now. <laughs> it's, like, it's, mm. broken. it's done. Yeah, it's cheating. just it's just sitting there you're now. You know, <laughs> wow. Fo- follow the rules. <laughs> wow. Like, Yo, but you said uh, you said you had a tag team. Uh, all money is legal. Yeah, me and my brother. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. My, tag my team roots. Champ? My roots run in tag team wrestling, man. Okay. Like, that's my. That's my baby right there. Nice. Yeah, man. So, so you grab a tag team, then uh, solo. Uh yeah, 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 for sure. I mean, if it's if it's with my brother, for sure. Oh Hell shit. yeah! Okay. Hell yeah! I'm. So I'm with that, man. Like, so, all day. So, all right. You know. Um. All right. Oh, I'm about yeah. to actually just. Bunch of weird questions right nah, now. Ah, it's all good. About bro. to put them in the hot seat real oh, quick, yo. Shit, hot. Um, yeah, yo. So this one is real weird. G, you can answer this one too. Okay. What's the worst slogan you could think of for a porn site? The worst. The worst. For a porn site. <laughs> the worst slogan. <laughs> Clapon.com. Mm-mm. I think people would like that. Oh man! <laughs> it's just the worst. The worst. The so, worst. So the worst would be like, you gonna catch something here, nigga? If you watch this site, that'd be it. Dot com. No, or, <laughs> or or all authorities welcome. What? All authorities welcome. All authorities welcome. That's mad weird. I'm like, wait, wait, hold on. So that, that means FBI, cops, CIA. Everybody's NSA. welcome. Like, yeah, you say some <laughs> shit like that, they'd be like, <laughs> yep. You know, you know, you ain't trying to watch no ass when you're not nah. watching you. Hell, nobody <laughs> is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who trying to touch themselves on a cop looking at you? Like, you know, it's weird. <laughs> what you got, Boofa? Oh, damn. <laughs> what you got for us? Comein.com? Oh, oh, they're gonna like that. Yeah, somebody's gonna like it. I, I, can, I, can, I can imagine a fat pervert like, oh, that's a come in where? Yeah. <laughs> On your face. Back, like, oh, back my door. <laughs> Backdoor.junk.com. Oh. <laughs> oh, there we go. Junk. Junk.com. Junk. It's called a junk. A I guarantee junk. they won't think that's perverted. They're like, hmm, what's this? <laughs> Very All right, uh, curiosity, yeah. You'll get some curity, curiosity. Yeah, 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 for sure. Some, some peepers. Yo, all right, this one is pretty funny. Yo, if or when you was a, when you was a kid, put it like this. Yeah. If or when you drew white people, what color did you use in a crayon box? I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> I just drew the outline. You just outlined them? Mm-hmm. Does it? <laughs> On the just white not- paper. On the white paper. Uh, I <laughs> you mean, just, just draw the, you just outlined the black and just left it. I yeah, mean, it. pretty much. That's I, it. I don't even think I even gave like them color. I just everybody was an outline to yeah, me. That's it. It's an outline. <laughs> uh, I think the only thing I colored was uh, was the clothes. I never used to color the skin. Just the clothes. <laughs> just yeah. the clothes. Yeah, just the clothes. Because the it was no I can't really find a color to match like me. I think I'd use peach, peach. Yeah. But it was like you would have, and you I, couldn't use white because white was just the weirdest crayon ever. Yeah, man, it was yeah white. Yeah, yeah I used to make white was here. Did you say peach? Yeah. Peach for yourself? Peach. No, for white people. Oh. To confuse the fuck out of me. Oh. <laughs> I was like, now, no, I was now just... the teacher got to call you home. <laughs> teacher got to call your house. We got a question. Uh-huh. We got a question. <laughs> oh no, shit. Why, why does your son think he's pink? 
He's, he's light skinned. That's what light. That's what light skinned guys. Skinned. It's called flesh tone. They call me flesh tone. Uh huh. That's what, that's what we us light skinned people. Light we, skinned. we colored ourselves light with. Skinny. I don't mind being dark. Yo, you nice. can't see my features. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> you gotta, you gotta, like Braille. You gotta touch my face to see me. All right, all right, I got, I got another question. Yo, if you could swap out talents with any bald headed guy, mm. who would it be? Does it have to be bald headed? Yeah, it gotta be bald headed. This guy got has to be bald. Okay, so real, you, we're talking you about have real to be person. Bald? Hmm? We're yeah. talking about a real person, not a movie person. You could, like whoever. If you got, if you could swap out his talents with the bald guy, who would it be? You know what I'm saying? Mm. I'm going Samuel. Mm. Mm. That's a good choice. That's a good choice. I mean, you could go Jordan. You know? I was thinking Jordan, but... I'll go Howie you know, Mandel. Howie Mandel's not bad. Yeah, I miss Bobby. I, w- I, w- I, would, <laughs> I would go Bruce Willis, though, too, also. Bruce Willis is a great fucking Vin- man. Vin Diesel. He's bald now? Huh? <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's, he's been bald Bruce- for a while. Oh, yeah, a, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's right. The guy from Transporter. Ah, uh, Jason. Jason Statham. Yeah. yeah, yeah. What? That's another great one. Damn. Well, then that means you're going to have to start whispering to all these people. Just... You know, nobody's going to be able to hear what you're saying. No, that's that guy <laughs> talks, too. That's crazy. Yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty damn like, good. Did you just whisper in my ear, my nigga? No word. Yeah. <laughs> But there's so many war headed guys you can swap. Like I swap out Shaq's talent. I I take his uh, commercials and shit. I don't know. So oh, Ty- oh. Tyson's been bald for a while. I don't want to be Mike Tyson though. But he's been bald for Fuck a while. Fuck it out. I'll, I'll you go. said his talent. You didn't say. You said Tyson. His personality. Yeah. Okay, yeah. I take his talent. <laughs> you what, Mike Tyson? Yeah. I, I love Mike Tyson. Yeah, I take yeah, Mike yeah, Tyson's Tyson. hands. Definitely. Oh, yeah. I kind of, I kind of. Thought about Tyson. That's how I fight. Uh, like I didn't, I, I didn't mean to kill him. You know, I just stuck my hand out to give him some money, and now he's dead. And yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. He's another person. <laughs> Remember, he had a cartoon too. Also, he did. Yeah, loved it. Oh, um, shit. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's true. That's true. Do you still listen to R. Kelly on purpose or on accident? Nah, I don't even listen to R. Kelly. Mm. On I never really did. I do, I, I do it on purpose. <laughs> On purpose. Right on purpose. I don't care. I never really listened to R. Kelly. Huh? I do it on purpose <laughs> because I I knew from the beginning what he was talking about. Everybody else was pretending like, oh, I didn't. yeah, he talk about somebody mm-hmm. his age. I'm like, really? I didn't. Really? I just think I could always get me. Yeah, I didn't. Listen, listen you R. got, Kelly got me. Really. I'll be honest. R. Kelly got me a lot of draws when I was in high school. Damn. That's, yeah, damn. because nobody was listening to what he was saying. They was just like, oh, this is a good grill. I want to shake my room. Yeah. <laughs> that's that hood mentality, and it got into yeah. everybody's soul. And then that's when we had the, ba- the what was that, the boom era? Where mm-hmm. all the babies came from? Boom bap area. The, the boom bap. Oh. Had, that's where all the boom babies came from. Yeah. Now we got people out here like, I don't know if I like old Kelly, but <laughs> he's, he's not a nice boy, son. Yo, <laughs> I, yo like, what's the... Right. I understand. I understand. What's the uh, yeah, what's true. the dumbest way you've injured yourself? You're going to laugh when I go. I'm going to have to go first. with my birthday <laughs> in January. Uh-huh. Bruh. Oh, man. <laughs> This is this is dumb because I don't do this. Like, (laughs) I was it was my birthday. Number one, number two. Me and my wife is with her her co-worker and good friend family at their like wedding like reception. Mm -hmm. So we at like this like little like village in China, like in the countryside in China, Uh outside the city. So, like I said, like, a lot of um, people that work in Shenzhen, they're from, like, these, like, villages in the countryside in um, China. Mm-hmm. They just work in the city. So, we went back to our co-worker's um, husband's uh, village. Uh-huh. So, we all partying and shit. And <laughs> we in the hood. Don't worry about that. Yeah, man. <laughs> shit. We so, out, you went back, it up. We so, you out, went back yeah. to the party? <laughs> so... <laughs> We out there partying and shit, and uh, her co-worker's um, dad is, like, this 60-year-old dude, 60-year-old, like, uh, Mafia boss. Asian dude that's, like, super fit dude. Him and his wife, they do, like, crazy cardio. They go hiking and shit, so the nigga's drinking. So he's, like, 
uh, you want some beers? I'm like, yeah, hell yeah. So he's like, ah, oh, you got some, I got some other stuff you want, like some liquor and shit. So I'm like, yeah, I'll have some of that. So I go upstairs and I'm chilling. This nigga comes with fucking Hennessy. I don't I'd drink have, Hennessy. Felt, I would have felt. I don't drink Hennessy, I would have been bro. like, mother, if you don't bow. That, My nigga. I'd be like, just give me a cup. <laughs> how'd you know how'd you know niggas like Hennessy I man? said yo I don't know if I should be offended I'd have been kind of uh, I'd have been kind of offended uh, and then I'd be like Should've. but I'm like there's no way in hell he he knows oh he knew nah yeah he, he knew nah nah yeah he did he smelled the grease in the chicken you, on you know him. why he knew he I knew. can't the rest the same reason everybody knows <laughs> black people Love Hennessy and Timberland boots. Yep. No, yep. I, I ain't have yep. on no damn Tims. <laughs> but <laughs> that's, that's Jordan's on. Sure. For yeah. some reason, that's, that's just spread, on. It's spread around the globe for some reason. So he, uh-huh. he hits you with half. Love Hennessy. He, he, he's like, I don't have Timbo down, <laughs> but I do have Hennessy. <laughs> Yo, he bust it out. You take Hennessy, you drink now. You drink now. So how, I was, was like, it like a gallon? You drank the whole bottle? Nah, bro. But he brought out the Hennessy and brought out some other shit. I was already drinking like the fucking Heineken's and shit. Oh, oh okay. I'm already like already washed up. Fucking three three cans in. Mm. He busts out the Henny. Now I'm over here. I don't drink Hennessy number one, and I'm not gonna mix mm-hmm. mm. fucking. That shit with no damn beer. <laughs> but what did I beer. do? Yeah. I mixed that shit with beer. <laughs> and I drunk some other Chinese, like, fucking 1,000 proof shit oh, no. on top of that. I'm dying to try that. And these niggas is no, there like, oh. Because yeah. I, I have a high tolerance from living in Japan and oh, no. having to go to these sponsored dinners and I being challenged by the, I'm being challenged by the veterans mm-hmm. or my trainers and shit to drink. It'd so my excuse- tolerance is like, pew. <laughs> you know ex- what I mean? It'd have been, excuse me, I'm going to use the bathroom real quick. Yo, yeah, yeah. So I'm just like, gong, 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 taking it back. I'm fucking, I go, me and my wife go to, like, the fucking sauna. I'm in the sauna just chilling. And I'm like, oh, shit, I am fucked. That's when I knew I was out of here, bro. Uh Like, before I black out, I know when I'm going to black out. Like, when I say, oh, shit, I'm done. (laughs) I'm in the fucking hot (laughs) tub, and I'm like, oh, shit, I'm done. That's, like, the last thing I remember... I remember going back to the place we were staying because they was cooking. I remember going downstairs, and that was it. My wife is like, yo, the next day, I'm knocked out on the bed. I wake up. I'm like, what the fuck? My wife is like, you know what happened? I'm like, no. She's just telling me. So apparently, I go downstairs. I'm eating the food. My hair's down, my hair's all in the food. <laughs> and it's these, it's these, like, her co worker's family, like, the older chicks are walking back and forth. And I'm like, hey, yo. <laughs> Every time they walk back, back and forth, I'm like, hey, yo. <laughs> then my ass go upstairs, like, her father, like, her co worker's uh, father, and, like, the other males in the family, they go to their room. I go to the room with them apparently, and I'm chilling with them niggas over there drinking more. Damn. Then I come back and I fucking slip, fucking twist my ankle. Oh. Then I go to the bathroom and I'm blacking out. I'm done. I'm in the bathroom. I'm fucking breaking shit in the bathroom. She says she came to the bathroom like. Apparently, I went in there, I started breaking shit. I take a shower, and I go to sleep. She goes to the bathroom. There's blood all over the bathroom and shit. Oh, shit. Yeah. Because oh, some shit some shit went down in, like, fucking China. Uh-huh. That's, uh, that had me, like, yeah, some bullshit went down. So I was, like, kind of tripping off of that shit. Because I'm drinking Henny, and I'm like, I don't drink Henny. He said, don't don't you bring Henny yeah. no more. <laughs> I'm, I'm like, I'm like tripping, so that shit was dumb of me to even do. Shit. See, you my, know what I mean? My, my situation, it just shows my age, so it's mm. not, 
not an exciting story. Yeah. It's just sad as shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, it's like normal day. You gotta I'm, bring it down a little bit. Yeah, normal day I'm walking. I'm actually walking to work. Mm. And like a normal person, step off the curb and my foot goes sideways. I'm just stepping <sighs> straight on the ground with my ankle. And I'm like, oh, that leg's done for today. <laughs> like, uh, so I'm like, no, but I still got to go to work. I've done it. <laughs> so I'm uh, limping to work now. <laughs> <laughs> I got to stand at work with a fucked up leg. I'm like, this is... I remember I had to be to work, rough. and I was rushing. <laughs> and I fell all the way down the train steps, nigga. That was for sad. Somebody came to help. Somebody was like, just stay there. Yeah. I was like, bitch, I got to go to work. Yeah, for uh, sad. Yeah. Bitch, I got to get paid, bitch. Yeah, uh, need that money, man. Look, I got on the train. was like, oh, yeah. my hip. My uh, fucking hip. My ribs. I still think I broke yeah. like, I think I broke a rib that day. Like, I was like, oh, my fucking hip. <laughs> I was walking slow as hell. I was doing the, the, the turtle walk. The, like, I was a giant in the forest. Yeah. I was giving him that, that slow motion. <laughs> I was like, I'm gonna make it, <laughs> but I'm not gonna be on time. Like, Most trust me. Yeah, so you gotta get call this in. slowly but surely. Yeah, trust me. Fuck like, and yeah, when I get there, man. I'm gonna be sitting down a lot. <laughs> That's <laughs> so, like, rough, man. Like, yeah, it was it was crazy. Bruh. Even my sister, she ran into me. She was like, Why are you walking like that? <laughs> so Yo, like, when somebody else can notice that <laughs> shit, you know you fucked. I was like, kind of broke my leg, but I'm on my way to work. You know you, when somebody else noticed <laughs> yeah. it yeah. and told you, like, you know you're you, done. Why are you walking like that? I was like, ah, I know I should be like, going, oh, but going to work. Fuck. <laughs> and you got to go to work, too. Yeah, bro. Like, you know, it's hard out here. Yo, <laughs> imagine, I, imagine having a wrestle after you get fucking injured. Oh, oh. my God. Yo, you want to know if you love wrestling? <laughs> like, I... I tell it. motherfuckers, you until it. you have to make a living off of pro wrestling, mm -hmm. like, you don't know you love it until you have to make a living off of this shit. And you don't really learn how to work until you have to make a living off of it. Because mm -hmm. you're going to have times when you're wrestling injured, mm -hmm. times you wrestling when you know you ain't going to get paid because some bullshit happened. Mm -hmm. Like, bro, it's something, man. It ain't no medical wow. in wrestling, is it? My, my nah, is. man. Like, you you be lucky if they take care of it. You know, usually wow. they would, or at least half. Oh, so you in, you encourage you encourage wrestlers to get Affleck. Yo, yeah. <laughs> that duck beat. Get, get 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 Affleck or get tape. <laughs> 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 your choice. <laughs> get your mind right. Yeah. Or get tape. Well, you know, choice is up to you. That, that's true, what you're saying, because that, yeah. that's when I realized I, I'm more than a fan of wrestling. Mm -hmm. When I, uh, let's say I hurt myself yeah. <laughs> yeah, and still kept wrestling. Yeah. <laughs> it was like, I'm good. Yeah, it's I'm the good. same, it's it the like, same thing. It was hanging from the bone. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm, I'm good. Right, it's, <laughs> the, same, on, it's the same yeah. shit, bro. Yeah, that's what I do. Yo, I'm a wrestler now. You gotta, you gotta <laughs> fight. You gotta fight through that Yo, shit. I've, I've been punched in the eye and had to go to work before. I was like, shit, I gotta go to work with this black guy. Oh, oh I, man. Dude. Yeah. I, that's, uh, that sucks, bro. That was tough. That was, everybody's like, what happened? Yeah, I was like, cause that's uh, all you're gonna hear all day. What happened? I was like, I got into a fight. You and I lost, nigga. All day. I lost. I accidentally, <sighs> that, ac completely accidentally. Yeah. I accidentally pulled my leg out doing a figure four. What? Ooh. Don't ask me how it happened, <laughs> but it, all right. <laughs> so me and my nephew, my nephew is about my height. <laughs> so mm. he, he he came at me full force. We're both hardcore wrestling fans. So he came at me full force. So uh, long story short, I managed to get him get him into the finger four. But yeah. before I did it, like I got him on his back, right? So as soon as I got him on his back, you know how. Uh, Rick Flair. Uh, Rick Flair used to do the the, the spin. Yeah. I, I, I tried oh to do the God. spin. Uh, That's what fucked me. It tore his whole leg off. <laughs> because I tried to I tried to do the well, I did the spin. The oh, spin was shit. successful. Yeah. But what I didn't realize is that my leg did not spin with me. Oh. <laughs> so uh. when I when I put him in the figure four, I was like, why does my leg hurt? 
<laughs> so he's he's screaming, ah! and I'm like, yeah, but why does my leg hurt? <laughs> so I'm like, all right. So I figure this shit out. I'm gonna let you go. I'm telling oh, him, I'm gonna shit. let you go because my leg, yeah. hurt. something happened. So he <laughs> he takes that as an opportunity to start punching me oh, in the leg. Shit. Yeah. That's all fucked up. So uh, <laughs> he's, he's full force punching the knee. That's pretty much out of socket at this point. <laughs> and he's just yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm like, stop. <laughs> he <stopped. laughs> it's like he kept, kept doing it so I finally let him go and then when I let him go my leg literally looked at like an empty sock <laughs> and then, oh, got the dead leg yeah and I just I just grabbed my calf and <laughs> twisted it back oh, into place shit. and it was like you're gonna die <laughs> and then I got up I was hopping towards him because I couldn't bend my leg mm, right away mm, mm, so I was I was hopping towards him <laughs> yo <laughs> it was like it's time to die buddy so, that is yeah, fucking rough, bro. Yeah, it, it came completely out. Like, I, I literally Yo. grabbed it off the ground. It was like... Was <laughs> I've cut fingers and all of that and bust chins open and yeah, bust my yeah. eye open. But yeah. I don't think, I don't think uh, I've broken anything. You fuck it up, you will. I think I've, I've broken <laughs> fingers. I've broken fingers. Yeah, yeah, fingers. me too. No, I've fingers, jammed nose. every finger I have, yeah. but I've never yeah. broken them. No, I've broken almost all my fingers. Uh, <laughs> jammed them all. I've cut, I've cut every last finger. Almost to a point where I've almost had to get stitches on every finger. Oh, a lot of every finger, bro. Every single <laughs> finger. Like I've had it to the point where I've, I think my I've almost lost my thumbs. Mm. Almost lost my damn near all my fingers. I've damn near almost lost before, mm. like several fucking times. Mm. God damn, bro. Yeah, several Hard, times. Hardcore. I think I chopped my the tip of my fucking thumb off, like. A little earlier last year, sometime. Mm. Yeah, oh, that's crazy. The whole time, <laughs> yeah, just the tip, like, yeah. just the tip of it, like. Pow. Yeah, that shit happened to me, mom. You got to be more one careful. of these fingers. That shit happened in a match. I think it's this one. That shit is like, it's like a little slice up. Mm -hmm. It's not like round. It's like a little chunk going. Mm. Bruh. Um, oh, hard, you ever did barbed bar bar wire matches and 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 all of that? Um, hardcore matches. I've, I used to work for FMW, man. Shit. <laughs> yeah, in Japan with Onita. I was real cool with Onita. That's what I'm saying. Like, when I tell you, I used to, like, be with, like, the Yakuza and shit. I used to be with him and his peoples is them dudes. Mm. You know what I mean? Yeah. They got the bodyguards outside the restaurant. You know, these dudes are eating that. And Onita, he would um, always invite me out with him. Like, whenever I was doing, like, FMW shows or whenever he was doing Zero One shows. Because uh -huh. I was in matches with him, like, the exploding, like, death matches, uh -huh. like, the barbed yeah, wire yeah. bat yeah. that explodes. I got hit with that shit mad times. Mm, I, I used to wrestle Onita all the time. That nigga used to give me the power drive on the, on top of the Japanese table mm. and the shit used to never break. <laughs> he ever give a fucking power drive on the table and fucking fall off and shit. Sturdy table. Bruh, I, I, done, I done all that shit. <laughs> Flu fluorescent lights too? No, 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 not that yeah, shit. Yeah, that's, that's just dangerous. That's the, the say, furthest, it again, G? Say, just, say it again? What? Sturdy table. <laughs> Sturdy. <laughs> China <Bro>. made. <laughs> The table made here. The yeah, table, table made around the corner. Tables are fucking brutal, bro. Or label no say made in China. Label <laughs> say made here. Made here. Made around the corner. <laughs> you got the address here. <laughs> yeah, I'm stuck. All right, yo. Uh, shit. Um, yo. Uh, yo. What's this slang word? It's yeah. not cool to use anymore. You all boo for AO. You mean period? Period. Like, you can't use this slang word no more. Like, this is not, you know what I'm saying? You fresh, funky. Uh, fresh man, and funky, my swag. friend. You are fresh swag. and funky. Swag? Yes. We're probably going to have hmm. to bleep this out. <laughs> <Swag>. <laughs> nah, he got it. He got it, though. Well, what were you going to say? I was going to say something horrible. <laughs> what, like, what was it? <laughs> I, I got to know that. I was going to say something horrible. I got to know that. So we are definitely bleeping yeah. this out. I was going <laughs> to say it, G. I got to know. <laughs> I gotta know. I don't think I want. I was it. gonna say. Gay. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah, uh, that's a slang word. I mean, that shit is gay. That shit is gay, sir. You can't. You can't even use that you no can't, more, bro. You, can't. you would get canceled immediately. Or, yeah. and it's not like we meant something bad. Yeah. Like you, was, you know what I'm saying? Like just yeah. a little. Yeah, you definitely can't use that word no more. Wow. Yeah. What about a uh, fat? 
Fat? Yo, that's fat. Nah. Well, nah. you can't use it because know, people man. take it personal now. Yeah. You, you calling me fat? Uh, nah, I'm you, saying. You pretty I, hot and tempting. <laughs> yeah, fat. Yeah, Yo. that's what it means. Uh, I'm saying, like, I don't know. It's some slang words uh, I still use. Like, I use dope all the time. Yeah, yeah, dope ain't going anywhere, man. I st- I still use dude. I use dude, dude, I, dude, that's, I, dude, that's, that's not going anywhere. I use, I use dude. I use bro. Yeah, yeah, that's staying. I use my guy. My guy. My, my guy. dude. Yeah. My dude. My uh, baza. Oh wait. Uh, damn, it's so <laughs> so many. Yeah, I, I use them all. I, I try not to. I, I try what about, not to go what about Mo? What up, Mo? <sighs> like Rifa, Rifa uses that shit. I know. Still. I know people that use Yo, Mo. Up, Mo? Is they they from like uh, Baltimore and shit like that. Yeah. Yeah. Mo, they, they didn't catch yeah. up to the New York. Yo, slide. what up, Mo? Yeah, they didn't, they didn't get to us. They didn't get to the sun. Yo, what up, nah. son? Yo, what, what up, up Dun? Yo, what up, Dun? What up, Dun Dun? Yo, what, what up, Dun Dun? What up, Dun Dun? What up, Dunny? So, what up, B? So, what up, B? You know what I mean? Yo, dead ass. <laughs> dead ass. Yo, Yo, let me tell you, my nigga. Let me tell you. That's facts. <laughs> That's facts. Yo, it's, <laughs> cra- it's crazy the way we look, bro. <laughs> Yo, when I came back, after being in fucking... You felt agua, right? Yo, after being away f- from New York for like five years straight... Mm-hmm. And just being on like the internet and seeing like all the memes and shit that they put up about New York, yo, <laughs> about how we act, I'm, I'm like, yo, that shit is so true. It's it's true. Not true. When it's I not true. when I got off the flight at JFK, I was looking for an Uber. Some dude, the most New York nigga you can <laughs> find, picked me up. Mm-hmm. Bro, this nigga was. He's like, yo, sign, sign, sign. Don't even worry, sign. Like, I'm finna get you. We're gonna get there in a minute. You heard? Spanish, yeah. Spanish dude from, from the Heights. Oh, Dominican nigga. He's like, Bobby, yeah, go ahead. Yeah, Bobby, we be there in no time. He's like, yo, dead ass, bro. He said, yo. Yo, bro. He said, yo. You waiting for me? In the back. In the back. This is your back? He didn't have the Spanish, like, he. it wasn't that deep. He just had everything else, you know what I mean? So he was from here, that's what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what was the first thing you ate when you got back to the States? Mm, that's a good question. Damn, the only thing I wanted was Spanish food, bro. Mm. The first thing I wanted was um, Spanish food. It was a spot called El Valle. Mm-hmm. And I just I just realized when coming here, I realized they have one in Brooklyn on Myrtle. Oh. Like right there, they got the sign right there when you get off the train. Yeah. I was like, oh, shit, them niggas is in Brooklyn? Yeah, it was that, El Valle. Mm, okay. Yeah, okay. the chicken chunks with the rice oh, and beans. Yeah. The chicken Bruh. chunks, yeah. Chicken yeah. Chunks. Yo, that's my that shit up, bro. That's my joint. That's my joint. I was like, yo, that's, what, that's the first thing you I want to eat. You like that? No, I'm just saying that nobody better not make a meme out of this shit, nigga, because fucking everybody just started fucking yeah. foaming at the mouth. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Yo, we just talk about chicken yo, chunks, man. nigga. I'm like, <laughs> I'm to go home and make that chicken chunks, nigga. I got to get some of that shit when I get back, bro. Shit make you. Fuckers. Damn, son. You know how the Let internet is, sicker. <laughs> Fuck it. Whoa. Yeah, that, was, that was that shit right there, man. Oh yeah. I needed Chief. that. You got anything else, G4? Okay. Well, okay. What? So when you're when you're home, really, what do you yeah. you cook yourself or you just go out? Nah, nah. I cook. Um. <clears throat> you got a you got a favorite spot out there? Oh yeah, my wife knows like all the dope spots, like. All the Americanized spots, you mm-hmm. know? Because mm-hmm. a lot of the food in China, they be eating, like, the parts of the animals that we don't fuck with, you know what I mean? I feel mm-hmm. you. So you got to be careful what you get, but she knows all the good spots, so... That's cool. we, we, we get a lot of takeout, yeah. you know? Yeah. We eat in a lot, you know? But mm-hmm. usually I'm cooking. Cool. Is the rat and the dog thing true about over there? The dog thing is true. The rat thing, I don't know. Like. So they really cook dogs? Yeah, so you can really go in a restaurant and say, "Let me there's, get a dog over rice." Let me, let me get a chihuahua on a nah, lamb. It's lamb only, a it's only, it's only a certain breed of dog. Oh, and they call one, it bow wow, right? Let me get bow wow on rice. <laughs> bow wow on rice. <laughs> Bro, I forgot what they call that <laughs> shit. It's a certain dog they eating. Yo, yeah, they, sorry for that dog. Yeah, but only in like certain areas in China is it allowed. Mm. Like in Shenzhen, where I live, mm. it's it's not allowed. So. Mm. They don't they don't cook any dogs in Shenzhen, so <laughs> where's, was, the, where's the weirdest thing you've eaten since since you was over there? Like Man, um like flounder vagina. <laughs> I'm 
pretty sure uh, you have pretty sure you had some octopussy. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> of course. <laughs> but yeah, what's, yeah of what's, course. The, what's the weirdest? <laughs> but the weirdest thing, um, damn, that's tough, man, because it depends on what you consider weird. I mean, weird, like, co- I weird had, to American. Okay, anything is I've, weird I've, to me. I've, so I've, I've eaten horse, oh, See, wow. horse meat. I would actually like to try horse. I don't know. It's that's, pretty that's good. Pretty tough. It's pretty good. That ass. Pretty good. I've eaten tongue. A what? I would not tongue. like to try. Like, that. like who's, who's, <laughs> who's is it? Cow tongue. Cow tongue. But it's like little strips. Yeah, I don't eat. Nah, I'm okay. I don't, it's yeah. like little strips. So I don't, that was just one of the things I don't fuck with. Yeah, you can't really, you can't really <laughs> tell. <laughs> I you, you ever seen I, a cow's tongue? I can tell. All, <laughs> that, <laughs> nah, nah, all nah. that grass flavor is in his tongue. No. <laughs> no tongue, nigga. You don't want it to doesn't. It, do, it don't look like that though. It's like. Look like it a chicken strip. It, yeah, yeah. They can be like, it's a piece of bacon. Nah, it's just like a so like, what a, is it, what it's like it a piece like? of pepperoni. Like, does it, oh, does it they taste like a pepperoni? It, kind of with less with with less salt. <laughs> uh, less salty. That's the good. That's the best oily. part of a pepperoni. No, <laughs> that's the best part of a pepperoni, man. No, no, check that. out all yeah. the oils. Uh, all the oils and spices. It has saltiness to it, but it's like okay. It's that's, not like pepperoni, but that would be the weirdest for me. The tongue. But I don't think I've even. Yeah, I've never even got that. Weird, so bro. you've had like deer and snake. I've, I've eaten deer, um, snake. Nah, I have, nah, uh, not snake. You haven't tried you no know, snake. I've had gator tots. Nah, <laughs> nah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't even gator eat. Tots. I wouldn't eat that shit. Really? <laughs> Honestly, nah, I don't want to try snake. Huh? Nah, nah there's snakes? some there's some shit I don't fuck with. Like, okay. I used to fuck with a lot of stuff out there. But there's like some things that just like nah, I'm not. Okay, what about frogs? I know they fish over there. Nah, I'm not fucking with that. You don't like frog legs? You don't nah. like no good old frog legs, boy? Nah. Man. I think I've had frog legs in the past. You've as a had kid. to. You've been as in the south. I think I've I think I've <laughs> yeah, had them been before. In the chicken but... legs, chicken feet. If it was oh, a, if they it love was a that green chicken, chicken it was definitely frogs. Chicken feet. Uh, they love chicken feet and. Do they eat chitlins out there? Nah. Ew. No, they I don't even eat. Out of all the shit they don't, <laughs> eat. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, don't eat even that eat shit. Chillers, yeah. I don't eat Fuck that shit that. either. I'm just saying, Chinese people don't eat chillins. Nah. Out of all of the shit they eat, but they eat all the other nasty shit though. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, they'll eat the face. <laughs> they'll eat. They'll eat the, the face right off. Nigga, the they eat their fish heads. Uh, yeah, but you ain't gonna eat no chip. I don't want nigga. no chip. How much meat though? is on a fish head though? Um, None. No. You're just, you're just <laughs> looking at motherfucker like a cat. None. None. <laughs> you just, just eating the skin and eyes. Now you just playing, playing, fucking, just playing with your food. Yeah, that's disgusting. Bruh, uh, like I can't. <laughs> uh, I, be getting, I be getting. Brother, yeah. Uh. yeah. <laughs> Say you know go eat your head. You know eat your Yo. head. Oh, fish. Brother, uh. Yo, I gotta tell my wife to take that shit out because I usually get the fish soup. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yo, it's like a big ass bowl. Yeah, of I was fish gonna soup. say it's normally a head in that. Yeah, but yeah. I don't like that shit. <laughs> I don't want that head in my Yeah, every time I, I don't even I don't even like to take that shit out myself. Well, I be told my oh, wife, yeah. yo, get that. You don't got you, that. I'm like, you like that shit. <laughs> yeah. You like that shit, so you take that That's fucking hilarious. nasty ass fucking out of here. <laughs> Nah, I ain't touching that shit. I don't want to see right. it. <laughs> yeah, let's, um, G, you want to wrap this up, B? Yeah, we're going to get out of here. Yeah. I'm sorry, for every, ladies and gentlemen, for uh, holding your time up. But we had a magnificent wrestler today. We had the we had the probe and, and poke. We had to ask questions. So thank you all for coming. We're gonna get out of here and we're gonna introduce ourselves one more time. I am Stable Shady, and we have it's your boy Kid of Soul. They call Coffee Weedston, and we also have. Hey yo, your friendly neighborhood homeboy, Bufa A yo, and the Boom Box. Hey yo, check us out: Instagram, Facebook, uh, Twitter, X, YouTube. Just put in Bufa A yo. Yes, sir. Would you like to tell people how to spell that? Because That's some of our viewers are B- just as slow as I am. U F F A. A Y O O O A Yo. I hope you all got that because yes, sir. I sure didn't. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> thank you for coming. This is another episode of Earth Up Radio. <laughs>